All right, let's watch this uh, Inside the Trapping Trail. We definitely forgot to watch it. In the winter, when we were traveling, we didn't build sod houses, we built snow houses. In Canada, they call them igloo, but here in Alaska, we call them apuya. We do a day of travel, and then we'd make a apuya. The next day, my father would set traps, spend the day there, rest the dogs, give them something to eat, and then the following day, we continue to the next place. We'd go to my dad's sister, who had a house at the bar. They had a small side house over there. We didn't have to do anything. We just visit with them, and my dad and my sister were glad to see each other, and they'd talk away while kids played outside or go to sleep. By the time we get back to our home, my father would leave us with our aunt or with my grandmother, and then he'd start on his trips and go check his trap line. We were not into 85 kind of time, you know. We're in a totally different kind. We're in ecological time. All right, cool. Let's see what's next. I was told that I was In your hollow, the king of my rock, the black sail, Lord of Pinna. If a hallock shimmer of summer time, the cat jacumania in your shop, pocket car now nago, if a tane. You knock at the key walk to our next shop. In your way, to put up the one exit. Damn, they destroyed the village. It is said that with each gust of, gust of wind, the powdery, powdery snow blew in every direction. Robert Cleveland. All right, let's go check this destroyed village. <laughs> The <laughs> Yeah, but cut it out with the snow. <gasps> Damn! Um. The wind blew my dog all the way. Okay. All right, wait a minute. I'm a little lost here. Oh, the wind was supposed to blow me over here. I see. I see. Okay, cool. I didn't know it was actually supposed to do that. All right. No, no, that's the four, four wind gust. Bro, what the hell are those things? Oh, I'm just screwed up.
Oh! Oh! Alright, let's go. Hi, Gwen. Today. What the hell? Hanakoma is a who is this man? <laughs> the heartbeat of the community. Let's see. Drama is something that's common to all cultures in Alaska. All cultures have a drum that may have some stylistic differences or differences in materials that's made, but it's still a recognition of life and vitality. And the drum mirrors the heartbeat. And when you continue drumming soon, it will be in line with your heartbeat. Because that's what it's supposed to be, the heartbeat of the community. And it symbolizes vitality. And it's, it's the most tremendous feeling to be in a room and to have one long row of all the drummers and to have that feeling of unity and everyone beating in harmony, the drum beat in unison, it's the most beautiful feeling. And to know that you're connected, you're on the land that you are connected to. And even if you grew up outside of the community, that which is in you comes from this area. And it's, it's the greatest feeling. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, come on, Foxy. Oh, don't you run. That's uh, more. Little people. Another one already. They're just like other people. They just happen to be very small and extremely strong. These are stories that are common throughout Alaska. It's normally that people are, you know, size from your elbow to the tips of your fingers, and they possess superhuman strength. So they may be tiny, but they can carry a whole caribou. And if you go up north and you talk to a number of the people in the community, they'll talk about having seen the little people. There's a place at home that we know, but we don't profess it to anybody. But it's not like the boogeyman. They can be mischievous, they can be ornery, or they can be helpers. And every now and then, we might have the opportunity to see them, especially if they want us to see them. The fact that it's across Alaska really tells you something about our history and how we interacted with nature around us. So these some little strong demons, huh? All right. <clears throat> Yeah, just broke them dog's ankle. All right, let's see what we're gonna be bringing this. Looks like over here, cause we're gonna need some light. All 
All right, let's get up here. Oh, yeah, yeah, get little. Oh, get little. Bro, he ain't never just crushed the dog like that, bro. Wait a minute, wait a minute, I'm confused here. just died I'm so lost So that's it. That's all we had to do was just let it stack up so we can move it. I was I swear I thought it was something else. I thought we had to do like a super jump or something. I didn't think I was gonna get it. Let's go. If we are share a real look, we think I look, kill out the legahoni. Who pick up a chapaluga? I see the poor people, the real repair lagaga. If we are share a real look, then Nahoni, I choose to hear a hunger. Alright. Going about our way. Let's see what's next. Terrible idea. That's what was next. Bola. The bola is what we call kilami town. And the kilami town is made out of braided sinew tied up to some heavy bone 
but you could twirl. In my case, we're catching ducks. When we're out uh, whaling, sometimes the ducks start flying. And they're good for duck hunting. You know, uh, if you're a whaling crew, you can't make too much noise. So you can't use a shotgun for um, getting some duck soup handy, you know? So Bolo was a really handy weapon to use for catching ducks. You know, the ducks fly in, you throw it up and tangles up the bird, and down they go. <laughs> Bola. Say, so you know, you can get up there. Stop playing. That all just like. Oh, there we go. That's kind of weird. That's dope. Where's the dog? Oh, this is just like extra ledge up. Let's go, Fox. What the hell is this? Oh, you're supposed to. Ooh. Hmm. Yeah, I'm rocking with this. I'm, I'm rocking with this. Who's supposed to get under there? Ah, uh, you. Sorry about that pause. Oh, that was just to get the dog back up here. Oh, and Get up there, girl. Why isn't it moving us up? Oh, there you go. She just missed. That's all. Let's go, girl. You got me over here tripping. Oh. 
Oh, I see. Ooh. Wow. Ooh. I was to say, please don't. All right, let's go. ชิลาตานะนุนะคิมะตะอินยุฮุลุกะสวะอินยุฮุลุมตาดุกะเมวนุตะฮะวะอะกะลานิเบะเชอะรอดุชะเปเรนะคิมะรอ <laughs> Go, go, go. Run. Run. Get away from this man. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> God damn it. I was doing so good at first. Uh, Jump! He's getting too close. for your life uh, go go run run he's getting closer <laughs> oh god. And the parsley kalwak to Agalan Igilaw Nigga Sikaranak Sishin Yakto. 